In this screencast, I'm going to show you one of the most important advanced search techniques for improving text word searching. If we look at the searches currently displayed here in our search history in line 1 and line 2, they already include truncation, but there are still additional ways that we can improve them. The problem with the current searches is that they will only find instances of the phrase pet therapy in that exact order, or animal therapy in that exact order. This increases the likelihood of missing relevant results, because authors express their concepts in sentences in a variety of ways, which can often be difficult to predict. For example, there may be an article that uses the sentence, therapy utilizing animals. When searching a phrase, it's always helpful to use an adjacency operator, also known as a proximity operator. These codes force a relationship between each word, while at the same time allowing wiggle room for how the phrase might be expressed in a sentence. The adjacency operator isn't the same in every database, so if you aren't sure what the adjacency operator is for a particular database, this information is always available in the database's help section. In Medline, we use the letters A, D, J, followed by a number. So if we apply this to our example, it would look like this. This use of a proximity operator means that the database has been told to show us articles only where animal appears within two words of truncated therapy, in either direction. As with all search strategies, it's important to look at the results and see if there's anything that needs to be changed in order to retrieve more relevant results. You may need to increase or decrease the number used in the adjacency operator, search for more synonyms, or consider different truncations. To improve this search further, I could search this instead. You'll also notice that I've added additional brackets to this last version of the search. The brackets have the same function in database searching as they do in math, order of operations. An understanding of brackets can also make your search more efficient. Instead of searching for animal therapy on one line and pet therapy on another line, I've used brackets to search for both at the same time. The brackets in this search tell the database to search for pet or animal near therapy in either direction. To further improve this search, I can add another synonym to the first set of brackets. I'm going to add or dog and then run the search. Instead of searching three separate queries to find articles about therapy dogs, therapy animals, or pet therapy, I can design this query to look for all three at once, while still providing wiggle room in the phrases and looking for alternate word endings. Remember, text word codes are your friends, but they take practice. If you have any questions about Medline, please feel free to contact us at ask.gerstein at utoronto.ca.